All right, Fit Lifer, Drew Canoli. It's another exciting episode of FitLife.tv. Remember, we're in this together. You know, I want to introduce you to some friends that I was introduced to by my friend, the Stanford Study. The Stanford Study revealed to me that there's no difference between organic and non-organic vegetables and fruits. So what I wanted to do is kind of invite them into the FitLife family, spend some time with them, oops, and really see if there was a big difference. Was the study accurate? The study is wrong, and here's why. Although nutritionally similar, although basically the same vitamins and minerals between the organic and non-organic, there's a big differentiation, and that is what's put on these things. One billion pounds of pesticides are dumped on non-organic vegetables and fruits every single year. Those pesticides have all types of nasty side effects, especially for our younger generation. Kids are more susceptible to these toxins that are in our environment. So, what I wanna do in my next video is actually show you the dirty dozen, or as I like to call them, the tenacious 12. And I also wanna show you, if you don't know how to wash veggies, I'm gonna show you right here how to wash your very own vegetables. I think it's very important that you get this Fit Lifer because this could make a huge difference in your life if you've been buying non-organic versus organic. I really wanna encourage you to stick to the list and invest a little bit extra more money to get the organic stuff. It's gonna make all the difference in the world. Drew Canoli, FitLife.tv. Remember, we're in this together. See you soon. GMO red pepper. I just don't think we can be friends.